Today we're troubleshooting a Ryzen PC that has no video out to see if we can fix it. First we'll boot it up with the HDMI plugged into the video card to see if we get a signal. So we're getting no video signal out whatsoever. The first step is to reset the CMOS, so we'll remove the GPU to get to the CMOS jumper. While it's still plugged in, we'll use a Phillips head screwdriver to reset the jumper, holding it for 20 to 30 seconds. After that, we will reinstall the GPU and try again. Unfortunately, still no signal, so the next step is to remove the CMOS battery and wait. After reinstalling the CMOS battery, we'll try one more time, and still no signal. So the next step is to swap out the GPU, and we're finally getting a signal, so the next step is to download fresh NVIDIA drivers along with DDU, so we can uninstall the old ones, install some new ones, and then run a stress test. We'll boot into safe mode, run DDU, reboot, install fresh NVIDIA drivers. This GTX 1070 is running way too hot, so we're going to fully disassemble and clean it up and then get it back in the machine. After we get some fresh thermal paste and get it all cleaned up, I've got it back in the PC. I went ahead and wiped it down as well. And with a custom fan curve, we are getting some pretty decent temperatures and this thing is good to go.